Hey, my name is Kareen, and I'm a high school senior. Crazy, I know. And this account is me documenting my college and senior year journey so I can look back on it and go, wow, I was a disaster. So excited to do that. Um, <laughs> but this video is about my half acceptance. So I was riding home on the activity bus, which is like our after not after school but after activities bus you can take and i got this call and it was like we're so pleased to let you know of your admission into the university of minnesota's liberal arts college and i was like oh yay thank you so much but in the back of my head i was like but i didn't apply to the liberal arts college now did i and uh spoiler alert <laughs> i did not that was my second choice so the college that i applied to was the college of biological sciences because i want to be a bio major and then go to med school, even though I know you don't have to be a bio major to go to med school. But anyways, um, and so I, I was like, okay, and so I got home, this is my earpiece for audio quality, and I checked my email, and they're like, welcome to the College of Liberal Arts, and I'm like, that's great, but that's not where I applied. And they're like, if we can let you in, if we decide to let you into another college, we'll let you know in writing. And so basically, I got... I didn't technically get rejected from the College of Biological Sciences. I just didn't get in, but I got into the College of Liberal Arts, so I got into the University of Minnesota. I just didn't get into the College of Biological Sciences. And now, to preface this, I want to say my ACT is above average for admitted students into the College of Biological Sciences. Um, not by a ton, but it is above average for that, that college, and it is well above average for the liberal arts college and for all the other schools in the University of Minnesota system. Uh, and so, and my GPA is two. Um, so it was not because of that. I think it overall it was because one of the admissions requirement for the College of Biological Sciences, which is something I did not know before applying, is that you have to have taken high school physics, which I never took because I did not think I would be super great at it, and I thought it would be super stressful and because I only took I only took three APs my junior year I mean I could have taken a four but my junior year I got super sick so it was really good that I had not tried to take on AP physics um I guess I could have taken regular physics but why would I take regular physics when I could take like AP environmental science anyways um but so I literally had not taken an admissions requirement and then also if you look at my transcript it just doesn't seem like I'm like super interested in biology because I have a problem with unnecessary dissections and so I didn't end up taking the classes that were very dissection heavy because I don't think that's right and if I do have to do dissections I'd much rather have to do them in college than in high school when it's completely unnecessary not that it's necessary in college all the time either um but yeah and so something to since I'm running out of phone storage the U of M was not a place I wanted to apply it was a place that I was forced by my father under the heavy threats of making my life a living nightmare to apply so I am not sad whatsoever I'm not devastated I'm just a little bit baffled that I didn't get in aside from the you know admissions requirement but it also made me feel like I did a good thing in that in my other applications I included an essay that basically said why I love biology all right thank you bye <laughs>